Hey guys, how you doing? So I wanted to make a quick video on how I organize all my hygiene items in the car. I think I have a very efficient and organized way of doing it and I thought maybe it'd be helpful to some people. So the first thing you gotta do is this. So this is what I did. Take a piece of paper and I made four headings. Use daily or more. These are the items that I use daily or more. I want to keep them in the front seat area. Just shower items. I keep those under the bed because I'm not going to need them as much. Probably not going to be able to shower every day on the road. And then use about weekly. Or two to three times a week. Want that semi handy under the bed, but maybe in better reach. Rarely used and restocking items. If I have small containers, these are the bigger containers that I don't need access to very often. So they can go pretty far under the bed. If I have to take a few things out to get to them, that's fine. So then I just write down everything I use. Toothbrush and paste. It's going to go there. I'm going to need a face cloth. Some examples of stuff I use about weekly or a couple times a week would be nail clippers. I have a bottle that I spit into when I brush my teeth inside, so that's up front, spit bottle. So these things I spread out in the front seat, in the glove boxes, and in the side compartments, in the door, just wherever they could fit. You could put them in one container and stick them in your glove box if it fits, but it was easier to spread them out. This has its own container with the flip-flops and everything in it. And then this has its own little pouch or container. And then so does this. So make those headings for yourself and then write down what you use on a regular day. Just think about your procedure when you take a shower, what, what you use and all the different products. Boy, guys have it so easy, don't they? Okay, so once you have your list, you just separate everything into categories to match your list. This is the daily stuff that I need in the front with me. This is everything I need just for showering, so I only just grab that when I'm going to take a shower. So this stuff here is stuff that I don't use that much, uh, maybe once a week or a little bit more, like nail clippers and stuff like that. So this is just how I chose to, to categorize those items. Again, it's not important what the items are, because everybody's are different. It's just how you organize them and how you categorize them. And then in this big pouch, I keep my extra supplies, extra lotion and soap, the thing I put in the bottle to spray myself if I want to shower outside, electric toothbrush charger, I even have some COVID tests here, extra flossers. So this is kind of my restocking stuff. I don't really need that, but every maybe a couple weeks. So I'll stick that way underneath on the bed, under the bed. So I put my wipes here and my hairbrush and my spit bottle. It's there too. In the console in the middle, I just keep some flossers. Sometimes I floss while I'm driving.
And this is the pouch. If I want, I could put them all in this pouch together. I'll just stick that in here. And right next to me, hooked on my refrigerator, is a spray bottle of water and a spray bottle of water and vinegar. So that helps me uh, wash up too. I also keep a washcloth up here, and then I use this for drying. And this I use to wash Bella's face after every meal. So breakfast and dinner, she has to get her face washed. So I keep that in here too. Unless it's uh, hanging, this is hanging on the handles to dry. I also have a collapsible electric tea kettle, so I can put water in that and heat it up if I want to wash up with warm water. And this little packing cube has about seven or eight face cloths in it and a couple little microfiber towels, like hand towel size. And stick that back there behind, behind my undergarments. So as you can see, I've got my brush, spit bottle, everything handy there. You can sit here and reach both glove boxes. And my floss is there. Well, I hope that helps somebody. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And also check out my van life Etsy shop called Let's Live Differently. There's a link in description with also a discount code. Thanks for watching. Take care.